Hey guys, Zach Calhoun here, excited to show you a really cool new feature on cloudpano.com. We are today within our demo tour here in the tour editor for Cloud Pano. And if you are wondering if your clients or you yourself have ever wondered, how do I capture leads using a virtual tour? You're going to love today's video. Okay, so when you are within your tour editor, I have four photos lined up here for our demo tour. If you look here on the left sidebar, you'll see a new option called Lead Gen. Click that tab. Um, it will default to off. Turn it on. And um, it's going to ask you a few questions. Questions. Where should we send leads to? So typically, let's say if you are a realtor yourself, this will be your, um, where, where you want to, your personal email or your work email or your admin's email. Um, if you are a provider, and you're being hired by someone, you're gonna ask your client, what email would you like me to send your leads that come from the virtual tour? Um, wherever they want those leads to go, that's the email you put here, okay? The next uh, question you must answer is, what message should we display to viewers? Um, basically, this goes above the request for information. So, you can put anything here. And if I, was, if I had a client, I would make sure to run this past them and just say, hey, you know, I I want to know what some information that you can provide or what what, what, we, what we should say. Here's a good idea. Uh, download our property info pack and schedule an info call. Add your info below. Um, that's just a option. You can put anything here. You can put um, track. You know, if if it's a real estate listing, track this listing. Or you could put something like um, get updates or if it's a restaurant download the menu click here what you really need is just, is people to give the information for something in advance and most of the time it should, it should just be have someone call me um, and you click save so I put get updates um, I click save and we, we, where your leads are going to end up being is down here okay the information that, that they added the time the date the name and the email we're actually be adding phone number as well pretty soon but I just want to show you a quick example of what this looks like. So now I'm going to press publish. I have my ambient sounds on. I'm turning it off. Okay. So when a user uh, sees this on their desktop, uh, just a typical tour, right? You're looking through it. Say you were to click into the living room and you're looking through the space. You're like, this is pretty neat. And as they're looking through the tour, they decide, well, hey, what's this icon right here? They click it. Request information. Well, I like this house. I want to know information, more information about it. How much does it cost? What, what, you know, who's the who's the owner? What's the expectations? Whatever the reason is, um, you click that button as a viewer. And I, as you notice here, I put get updates, right? And you put your name and enter email. You can put anything in this little area right here. You can put um, send me a property info pack, um, schedule a call today. And basically what happens is you now have your viewers information. The person who's viewing the virtual tour, they will give you their information because they want to know more. They're essentially raising their hand. Let's type it in and say, I'm saying, I'm Zach. Please email me at Zach at cloudpound.com because I want to buy this property and I want to know how much it is or what the dang situation is, or I want to know what the square footage is or whatever it is. You click submit, and that information gets sent over to automatically to the to the email that you input. So whether you are a provider creating a virtual tour for a client and they want leads to come from it, or whether or not, whether you own this tour yourself and you want leads to come to you, you now have a quick way to connect with your viewers. This is a really basic way to what we call it lead gen, a very basic way to, to capture some leads and add more value for your clients and more value for you as a Cloud Pano Pro Plus user. Thank you so much for watching this video. And of course, if you are wanting to become a Pro Plus user on cloudpano.com, which means unlimited hosting, unlimited tours, unlimited 360 photos on your uh, on Cloud Pano software, and use your own domain name, white label your tours, full customization, and view them all in VR, all the other features we have. We have a lot of features. Um, I, th I would pretty much give you the best advice possible, which is click Go Pro Plus, become a Pro Plus member, and lock in your pricing now while you still can before we raise it up. Um, we appreciate you guys. We love y'all. And of course, thank you for watching.